Hi guys, welcome back to a game review and today we are going to be reviewing here Roller Coaster Tycoon Classic. Now I bought this game here on Steam for 20 bucks, 19.99. Now what this game is all about here is uh, building your favorite theme park and you have all sorts of scenarios you can build roller coaster you, you can build water rides you can build um, restaurants and food stands for people to go eating on and uh, we are gonna have a look at the pictures here at first here you can see roller coasters here that you can build and paint them up as well now you can build your own uh, rights on this game by using here the toolkit you have different types of objects which you can place on your team park to make it look nice like this toolkit right here and uh yeah here we have more roller coasters but those are not rideable because those are going into the ground here we have more pictures of more roller coasters that you can build. These are all the toolkits here you can use to be able to build your, your roller coasters here on different types of parks. All right. Uh, this game was uh, built for PC in 2017. That game came out on that date. Now, this game is rather old because it has old graphics as well. It doesn't have the, the modern graphics as we know it from today. So once I get in game, you will see older types of graphics. Uh, the original game was Roller Coaster Tycoon 2. This is where this game originated from. So they did a lot of work to this game. The original game was uh, Roller Coaster Tycoon 2 for Windows Vista, I think it was. Back in 2002, I'm not too sure about the date now. Um, yeah, you can, you can, like I said before, Build your own theme park and roller coasters and all the rides that come with the game. You can also finance your your uh, theme park. You, you can do a lot of marketing and financing. Take care of your your finance there, and have your park in tip top condition and have it running all the time. And you can make a profit as well by inviting the guests that will be on your rides. Um, what else can we see here? We have the Forest Frontiers theme park. We have here the, where is it? We have here the historical fantasy theme park. You have the T-Rex theme park, here the rock and roll theme park, and we have here Back to the Future here from the Golden Twenties as well. And then we have here the toolkit, which you can use it to be able to build your parks. So we have here the, the Six Flags park as well. You can build different types of parks. We have here 17 new scenarios that we can do on our park here. And we have uh, 95, where did I see that? Uh, 14 new parks, 17 new scenarios. Now, where did I see that about uh, 95? We have 95 other things as well. Yeah, uh, park scenarios. 
uh, we have 95 classical park scenarios on roller coaster tycoon classic and roller coaster tycoon 2. so yeah 95 classical park scenarios all right brilliant i think i explained the toolkit toolkit is where you can build your park with all right now this game requires a system here windows 7 don't think anybody's using windows 7 anymore but the game will also run here on windows 10. processor intel 2.4 gigahertz you can read that for yourselves if anybody is using windows 7 it will run on windows 7 as well all right so you have your information up there anyone who wants to translate their german into english can do that i'm not gonna read it out for them i'm just here translating some stuff that i find interesting to talk about in this new game that i'm going to be playing i'm going to be making a couple of uh, episodes on this game once i know how this game works i can show you the the um the in-game stuff before i start building that i can do it as well but i have to kind of figure out how to build my team pack first before i can make a video on it because it's the first time playing the game so that is it guys let me know what you think of this new game i hope everybody understood what i was talking about <laughs> thanks for watching guys and uh we will see you in the next one bye bye